Dateline, Pennsylvania, where one city has entered the 21st century 50 years ahead of schedule. Welcome to Punchbowl, a city built for the space age. Here in Punchbowl, experimental science and state-of-the-art technology create a futuristic paradise, the lights of which have never been seen. This is a city unlike any other, free of crime, pollution, poverty, and other urban blights. Menial labor is a thing of the past, thanks to all the robots who keep Punchbowl running like clockwork. People can't stop talking about it, and why should they? Punchbowl is a model of good old American ingenuity. Much of it developed by famed scientist Dr. Herman Y, now a naturalized American citizen working for the good guys. But who's funding this fantastic foray into futurism? Why, none other than billionaire playboy industrialist Andrew Monday. America's favorite rags to riches story is the visionary who's calling the shots in this town. At the grand opening ceremony this morning, the world's richest man had this to say. Here in Punchbowl, for the first time in human history, life is what it was meant to be, free of all unpleasantness. Why, someday the entire world will be like Punchbowl, but for now, it stands alone, a beacon of purity and human potential in a world of social upheaval and moral turpitude. Bold words from a bold man. But perhaps the only thing more unlikely than this orphan's rise to fame and fortune is the city he's built, where everyone is invited to drink their fill of the future. And no one has a care in the world. Ah, oh my goodness! Get your hands off my weenie! He stole my hot dog! Oh my goodness! Oh my! Looks like he's having some kind of brain seizure. We'd better find some way of relieving the pressure in his head. Oh, God! Ah! Not like this! Did I just see someone... Wow, you someone sure calm him down. Brain? He's not even twitching anymore. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, silly me. I haven't even introduced myself. I'm a guide bot here to provide any information you might need during your stay in our fair city. Would you like the full tour? Oh, come on. I can tell by the look on your face. You're gonna love Punchbowl. Follow me. We've got so much to see. I've got a whole data tape filled with 640 kilobytes of fun facts about Punchbowl. It'll take us a few hours to get through the whole thing. Why don't we just walk around a bit so you get around pretty well for someone with a gaping hole in his stomach. If you like, we can visit Punchbowl General Hospital and have that looked at. Oh, but there's so much to see first. Come along. What? Who? There seems to be some kind of commotion down the street. Never a dull moment in Punchbowl. Let's go have a look. Good morning, officers. Be quiet, Guidebot. All right, buddy. You're coming with us. But, officer, we just started the tour. The tour's over. We don't want a sick bum in an ugly tie walking around on opening day stinking up the place. Nor do we actually want to touch that guy. Ugh. Exactly. So we're just going to stand here nice and quiet, and you are going to get in the back of the squad car, and we'll all be happy. Well, I won't be happy. We're waiting. Tap, tap, tap. I guess you don't have any choice. Let's not make this any harder than it Killing needs me. to be. <gasps> it's just like the fortune cookie said. Freeze! Don't move! You're surrounded! What is it? Oh, I see. You've got gas. I'll just head over here for a minute while you, uh, relieve the pressure. All right, buddy, you're going downtown. Hey, hands oh. right here. Something's broken. Ah! Oh, you my brain! Woo. Have you thought about changing your... Wow! Spit that out! I got a wife and kids! <laughs> 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 
Oh, oh, we'll never get anywhere unless you push those fellas out of the way. Walk up behind one of them. Now give him a gentle shove in the right direction. <laughs> 